welcome back to Clean Fill Wanted again. Still working on this Enfield cabinet. Gonna work on the molding. I do have my brace back on. Yesterday my hand was doing great and this morning I really tweaked my thumb somehow. So we're back to wearing, wearing this. This giant wing nut on the Stanley 45 hits up against the fence on a piece like this. So I have to have these spacers in here to uh, get this far enough away from that with this still hanging over the edge so that the fence is not interfered with anything below. Part one done, now the long process of changing out the blade on that and resetting a fence. Right after I made that sticking board, like it was like two days afterwards, I came up with an idea to help hold pieces up and that's a little cam lever piece, which fits really well. It's just a little cam, offset dowel rod into it. But a very, very quick search afterwards showed that there are other people who have done this a lot. So I'm assuming that somebody else did it first. I saw it and got it in my mind. Whoever came up with it first, boom, good on you. That's smart. If you make a sticking board, make cams. cupped shaving. It's quite awesome. This is a 45 degree fence. These plug into the holes down here, but you would plug these ones into this fence so it's double backed up. Take the piece, put it right there, and you're able to plane it a little bit better. I use that basically to mark a depth, which is about the right depth. That's a little shy of it. I used the rebate shoulder plane to skewed iron shoulder plane to make that groove from the marking gauge a little bit wider so that 
this can register in the middle of that. Basically, that is my molding. I have uh, these two actually lead to a really nice point. Probably not 45 degrees exactly, but they meet up absolutely beautifully. It's not to scale as what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be actually a little taller, probably down to here. I'm actually really happy with this. This this is fantastic. I'm, so tomorrow I'm gonna worry about the latch real quick, and then I'm gonna figure out what to do with the knob. But this is awesome. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, comment so you don't miss the other stuff. And wow, I mean, wow, really.